Hi friends, welcome back to Team Education. Friends, in this video, we are solving problem on first order and first degree differential equation. Okay, given problem is solve 1 plus e to the power of x by y dx plus e power x by y into 1 minus x by y dy is equal to 0. By the observation, we can say the given differential equation is in the form of m of x comma y dx plus n of x comma y dy is equal to 0. Friends, if the given differential equation m dx plus n dy is equal to 0 form, we have to verify which is an exact or non-exact. If it is an exact, how you can say that is exact means you have to do dou m by dou y and dou n by dou x. If both are equal, then you can say which is an exact. If both are not equal, then you can say non-exact. We have a different methods to solve the non-exact. Okay. Now, in this problem, we are verifying the given problem is an exact or not. If it is an exact, then the general solution we have integral of m dx plus integral of n dy which is equal to c. Here you have a y is a constant and this is a free from x terms. Okay. If it is non-exact, then the method also I will, I will discuss in the next videos. Now, anyhow, first we are verifying which is an exact or not. How to verify? Do m by do n, do n by do x, we have to do. For that first item, what is the dx question here you have? m. In the given problem, what is the dx question? That is m, 1 is, m is 1 plus e to the power of x by y. And dy question is n. What is n you have in the given problem? e to the power of x by y into 1 minus x by y. Now, we have to find out do m y do y. I am differentiating uh, m partially with respect to y. So friends, while differentiating partial with respect to y, we have to treat all other variables as a constant. Now is there any y term in the m? First term? No. So this derivative is 0 plus e power bracket derivative is e power bracket into bracket derivative with respect to y. Here x is what? Constant. Now y is in denominator. So 1 by y derivative minus 1 by y square. Yes or no? I repeat again e power bracket derivative is e power bracket and x is a constant while differentiating with respect to y. So x I have written alone 1 by y derivative to minus 1 by y square. This is dou n by dou m by dou y. Now dou n by dou x. Dou n by dou x. Here you have a product of two terms. First term is containing x term and second term is also containing x term. So I am going for a uv rule. Okay. First, first term into second term derivative to here you have 1, 1 derivative with 0, minus, I am differentiating partial with respect to x, but here you have y, so write down 1 by y is uh, alone, x derivative is 1. So first term into second term derivative is completed, plus second term, what is the second term? 1 minus x by y into first term derivative with respect to x, that is e power x by y, e power bracket derivative is e power bracket, and what is the bracket you have? x by y. Now x, x is in numerator, x derivative is 1 into 1 by y is a constant. Now I am simplifying dou n by dou x. What will happen you see? This is 0 minus 1 by y means minus 1 by y e to the power of x by y. Now 1 by y okay plus 1 by y e power x by y plus into minus minus x by y into y y square e power x by y. So this negative term and the positive term both will be same. So these are two are getting cancelled. Then you will have minus x by y square into e power x by y. Once you observe this dou n by dou x and dou m by dou y both are equal or not. What is the dou m by dou y? Minus x by y square into e power x by y. What is dou n by dou x? Minus x by y square into dou n by dou x. Therefore, you can say dou m by dou y is equal to dou n by dou x. Therefore, given problem m dx plus n dy is equal to 0 is an exact. So, whenever it is an exact, we have the general solution is integral of m dx plus integral of n dy is equal to c, where y is a constant and this is free from x terms. So, don't take the x term friends, right. This problem, we can also cross verify friends. It's not an issue. Now, you observe, I am writing integral of m dx. What is m? 1 plus e power x by y. So, 1 plus e to the power of x by y into dx plus integral of n dy but here you should not take x terms what you have here e power x by y this is a function of x this is also function of x so don't take this term so in this case this is you can write 0 dy is equal to c only now 
here while integrating with respect to x you have to treat a uh, y is a constant only so this is one integration with respect to x is x e power bracket integration e power bracket by bracket derivative two with respect to what x now x uh, this is x by y one by y is a constant and x in uh, x derivative is one so you will get a uh, one by y and uh, zero is zero only i am not taking this term then you will have a is equal to c sorry this is is equal to c now if we simplify this then we will have x plus y into e power x by y is equal to c is the general solution for the given problem